world, this is Chris Prince from Slash Gear. Uh, today we're taking a look at is the Apple iPad 3. Uh, this is the third generation iPad, just called the iPad, the new iPad, uh, with retina display, a slightly higher definition than this device, which is the Nexus 7. This device is called the Nexus 7 because it is the newest in the Nexus line of devices from Google, meaning it has an, a vanilla version of ice cream, uh, not ice cream, uh, uh, of whatever Google's treat is at the time, is what that means when it's vanilla. Uh, and at the moment it is Jelly Bean, which means the newest version of Android, uh, version 4.1, which is what you're seeing here, uh, is on this device. Now, uh, these devices both uh, start off with completely different versions of software. Uh, this one's obviously running iOS. Uh, we'll pop that open like that. That's your opening screen. Here we have a slightly new version that you might not have seen yet, where it is, allows you to go to this Google thing here or unlock screen. We'll just go to the unlock screen for now. Um, the differences in the home screens are obviously that uh, there's just icons here for Apple. On the uh, Google device there's obviously very big uh, widgets. You're also able to put those same sort of icons on this device, but uh, it's not that way at the moment. You can go in your app drawer, like so, and get those. There is no app drawer on uh, an Apple device like that with iOS. There is on Android. You've also got all these widgets like so. Now. These two devices are obviously running very different software, but they are also very different devices. They're they're not really suited to be to be uh, compared to one another other, one another other than the fact because of the fact that they're both sort of hero devices for their respective companies. The iPad is obviously Apple's uh, very much Apple's kingpin as far as mobile goes, other than the iPhone, whereas Google's uh, tablet line is non-existent. Uh, beyond this device and maybe the Mob the uh, Motorola Zoom, which came out a few years ago, or you know a year ago, whatever you want to say, um, where the iPad is sort of an all-encompassing device. Uh, you know, Apple is completely dedicated to this. Uh, this device right here is more aimed at their market, at Google's market. So you've got Google Play right here. You tap that, and this uh, is the place where you buy all your media. Uh, from everything from books to magazines, movies, TV shows, and uh, apps, of course. Back on the home screen, you can see that each of these widgets that come with the device are aimed at the market right out of the box. So you know that this is a device made for that, to work with the cloud, uh, project things to the other new device that's called the uh, Nexus Q, which is very similar to the, the Apple TV, by the way. And... The whole device is made for that. It's also extremely cheap, which is a uh, it's costs two hundred bucks, uh, one ninety nine, on the market, and uh, has a quad core processor inside. That's really good. It's for Android. It's uh, the Nvidia Tegra three, whereas the uh, iPad, this version of the iPad anyway, the the most inexpensive version of the iPad three, uh, runs. It, it costs uh, four ninety nine, and has an Apple uh, dual core processor in it, but you know, each the amount of cores doesn't necessarily matter in this case. As you can see, they're both really quite swift. But that's how it goes. Now, both these devices are obviously available right now. This device has been uh, available for several weeks uh, or months, and this device has just come out today, so you won't be able to get it shipped to you at this moment. But it'll be coming extremely soon. Uh, this device comes in a couple different colors. The iPad comes in black as well as white, that's just the front, whereas the back is always this lovely silver. Uh, the Nexus 7 comes in black and white, which is the one you see here, or it also comes in black, which is this color. So it's black on the front either way, uh, but the black version has a silver outline and a black back. There you have it.